guess what I found that you know I went coming to a success of fitness or maybe something I can compare it with maybe it might be helpful for you in achieving um, uh, your goal I what, what I find so far when coming to us achieving our goals or, or I can maybe relate or compare the success rate of a this program and your weight loss how they will look like a lot of us we're gonna embark on a journey it might be not weight loss it might be maybe getting married buying a new car maybe uh, buying a new house or maybe finding a new love or maybe finding a new hobby or maybe starting a new activity or maybe starting a new career or maybe getting promotion or making maybe maybe making more money but the challenge you're going to face here is not just only one of those things and in weight loss there's a dynamic loss of achieving it and then i think this dynamic loss of achieving this it happened in a workplace it happened in sports it happened in marriages it happened in schools it happened in so many places it happened in parliament because without these three components of these you know uh, principles yeah, our weight loss uh, goals, they become empty, they become void. And that's why I say these are the most components you are going to practice. Or it might be the rituals that I see corporates, they practice them in making it success. You know, because I could imagine if you work and you want a promotion and you never show up at your workplace. Or I could imagine if you work and you expect your pay to be paid every day, maybe you skip 10 days, 15 days and you want to be paid maybe twenty thousand dollars try it and let's see what happens i can tell you they will be showing you the door where's the door and you're not gonna even get the amount of twenty thousand dollars you're looking for maybe you're gonna get maybe sixty percent of that or maybe seventy five percent of that because they are going to cut all the days that you've taken away because you have not show up in time it's windy it's sunny it's stormy you will have to show up that's the only way you get paid that's the only way people they Start, you know, valuing what you say, your respect, you earn it through that way. At your workplace, is the same thing. You earn your respect by committing yourself to do the things that you say you're going to do. You get the respect or you get the rewards you said or you get to be recognized by being consistent in what you do day in, day out at your workplace. Other thing is that they look at, are you disciplined in your time, in delivering your project, in coming or living in time? Are you disciplined? in doing the things the things that you said you will do they matters because even in a weight loss is the same protocol is the same system that you're going to apply are you committed are you disciplined are you consistent with your programs it might be meal plan it might be showing up for your exercise it might be doing your walking it might be doing your meditation maybe it might be whatever the rituals it might be got to do with the weight loss are you really consistent in following up with that that do you show up every time because weight loss is going to work with the same protocol you use when going to workplaces you show up every time you are consistent you deliver in your project you, you do what you say you will do the weight loss is going to be the same principles you are you're going to apply to your workplace because you need to be committed you need to be disciplined you need to be consistent and you need to do what you said you're going to do if not, that's why at workplace they have mentors, they have bosses, because mentors and bosses are the one who always make you get so consistent, get you so disciplined, get you to be so committed, because you know he's always watching you, he's always asking you, hey, did you deliver that project? What's happening with that client? Did you call them? Did you send an email? Okay, can you also CC me or beep or whatever it might be? But that's the way how it worked and then sometimes your mind needs a mentor but well in fitness sometimes yes i believe you might need a coach especially if you're not getting the results you want so why this thing i'm telling you that i said are going to be crucial because these are the things we all know that are crucial in our life day in day out so may you need help or maybe you need to ask me more questions what is the best way how to do it or how to get it you know how to find me we can chat we can talk just drop me a message, inbox me, I can be, I will be happy to hear from you and we can share a few things, perspective, what I think you should be implementing in your program or what you should be doing. And maybe the things that I'm saying, they might really not be the ones which are making success, but I know in every way in the world, these three recipes are the ones which have made success. 
please if you have a chance i will ask you to just visit my instagram account it's holistic underscore uh, lifestyle underscore underscore coach or you can go to youtube it's the same thing or you can go to tiktok it's holistic underscore lifestyle coach i mean lifestyle underscore coach holistic underscore lifestyle underscore coach so thank you very much for watching this video please subscribe like comment drop message whatever you want and i will be happy to hear from you and have a great day ahead of you and you take care thank you